It's been a while since I've done a fun fact with Discord. I apologize for that, so what do you say we get right into it? In the original drafts of A New Hope, R2-D2 was going to speak, and with a very foul mouth at that. While this would become his signature beeps and boops, the reactions of the characters that could understand him, namely C-3PO and other droids, were largely unchanged. I mean, R2-D2 has been around since Phantom Menace. Bro's seen some stuff, I don't blame him. There is a debate among scientists over how to classify giant pandas. Are they bears? Or equally possible, are they raccoons? If you think those two things are entirely different and cannot be confused, you don't know pandas. And then there's the extreme mode, red pandas. When a crow dies, the crows of the dead's murder, a group of crows, will gather around to not only mourn the dead, but also search for the cause of death to warn other crows. If the death was of other animals doing, yes, humans count as animals, they will get very noisy and start to call the news to other crows as a warning. Should the killer return, the crows will become hysterical and get noisy again, sometimes swooping at the killer if they were a wild animal. Don't mess with crows, they have hearts. Anonymous sent thousands of all-black faxes to the Church of Scientology to deplete all of their ink cartridges. I wish I could be that chaotic good. The idiom, seeing is believing, leaves out half of the original sentence. The full quote from the 17th century English clergyman Thomas Fuller is, Seeing is believing, but feeling is the truth. I want to say that would be a good quote to follow, but sometimes feelings becoming facts has become a downfall. Annually, the world's population consumes so much Nutella that if you were to gather all the jars used in one year, you could span the entire length of the Great Wall of China eight times over. I mean, have you had Nutella? It's, it's good. It's really good. I'm eating some right now. You don't know that. In Pokemon's first three games, the NPCs claim that the Psychic type is weak to Ghost type Pokemon, but there are many problems with this. First off, more well known, the only ghost types at the time, the Ghastly line, are poison type and therefore weak to psychic moves. This is further held up by the fact that the NPCs are lying to you. In Gen 1 games, psychic types are actually immune to ghost type moves. Additionally, while many people ask for a light type to be added, the fighting type already acts as such. In Japanese, the fighting type is the hero type, interestingly contrasting with the dark type being called the evil type, and the dark being weak to fighting. To further prove such, the psychic type is weak to dark and beats fighting. This reflects a common plot device, illustrated best by Star Wars. The hero Luke is nowhere near as strong as the wise mentor, Obi-Wan, but manages to defeat the villain, Darth Vader, but not before the mentor is killed by the villain. While not being a literal light type, fighting type is still the best match for such a type. On other Pokemon type related subjects, the most common type is water, while the rarest is ice. West 21 Arctic, did you just turn my entire fun facts with Discord into Digino Gaming? In The Crucible by Arthur Miller, there was an old man named Giles Corey who was killed by being pressed to death with giant stones and remained silent. This was no random event the author put in, because there were historical records during the Salem witch hunts of an old man named Giles Corey who died by being pressed to death under heavy stones, and his last words were not a confession, but instead were the equivalent to the middle finger, and were more weight. Thus, his farm remains under his family's ownership. That is a hell of a way to go out in that time. The 2D platformer Shovel Knight is actually rendered as flat textures in a 3D space, as making it that way made it easier to program and find bugs. Oh, that explains why the file size for Shovel Knight is so big. The highest grossing film of all times is the James Cameron Avatar. And if this fact doesn't make you angry, think for a second and see if you can name any character from the movie. Then watch Endgame. Which is slowly making its way to number one, if it hasn't already by the time this video comes out. In SpongeBob SquarePants, there is an episode where Bubble Bass uses a strange lingo to order food at the Krusty Krab, prompting Squidward to quip, We serve food here, sir. The reason Squidward is confused is because Bubble Bass used diner lingo, a form of verbal shorthand diner waitstaff use when passing orders to the chef. The fact SpongeBob recognizes and deciphers the lingo heavily implies SpongeBob once worked at a diner. However, the only issue with this is SpongeBob did not make what the diner lingo was supposed to be. If you actually go and look up what Bubble Bass ordered, it is a very, very big sandwich. Mega Man is not called Mega Man in Japan. Instead, Mega Man is called Rock Man, or Rock for short. Proto Man is also not Proto Man, but instead is called Blues. Mega Man has a sister named Roll, and there's a side character named Bass, or Bass. It's, I think it should be Bass because what's about to come up. 
Altogether, they are rock and roll, blues, and bass. Love it. Love it. And a ding dang finally. Before Champ Post read, art used to be something to cherish. Now literally anything could be art. This post is art. Later, it would be photographed, framed, and then sold for $90,900 on eBay. Oh look, 4chan did something good for once.